Hey there, pal. I've seen you on the forums. Huh? You're into that new free-to-play game, aren't you? Oh yeah, I love it. I play it every day. It's a lot of fun. I know it's a lot of fun. I play too. But isn't it a drag to play without points? Well, you can do a lot more with those points, sure, but I don't have a lot of money. And it's still lots of fun for free. Well, what if I told you I had a code for 10,000 points that I could give you? 10,000? I could get a mount and a house with that many points and still have plenty left over for potions. I'd love that. Well, I'll send the code right over then. Wait, why would you send me that many points? I don't even know you. Well, it's a new promotion, that's all. Totally legit, I swear. What's your login information? I'll send the code over. Well, I'm not supposed to give that out. That's right, of course not. That's very safe of you. I could email it, but, oh, email isn't secure either. Someone could intercept the code. How about I just mail you the code, like in an envelope? It'll only take a couple of days, and that way, you'll be sure to get it, and your account information is perfectly safe. <laughs> well, I don't know. Ooh, Chip is in a tricky situation here, isn't he? He knows he should be safe, but 10,000 points for his favorite online game? Ooh, that is a lot, and it's very tempting. Mr. Crimp is very persuasive, too. See how he agrees with Chip and says that giving out his account information isn't safe. Then he says email isn't secure either, leading him to ask for Chip's home address, as if that is the smartest thing. Sometimes, especially in online games, we don't think about where people really are in the world, since we play with people all over the country or all over the world. We don't often think that the people we're chatting with could actually be local, even right next door. While Mr. Crimp's offer to mail the valuable code to Chip might sound like a good idea, giving out any kind of personal information, your account information, your age, address, phone number, what school you go to, what sports team you play on, or anything like that, is never safe. Never a good idea. If someone is trying to get you to give them your personal information, no matter how innocent it sounds, or how good a deal it might be, don't do it. Log off, block them, break off the chat, or tell a grown-up. Be smart and stay safe. Now, let's see what Chip does. No, I'm sorry. I can't give you that. It wouldn't be safe to give out personal information to someone I don't know. Besides, I don't really trust you. You look like you're made of pure evil. No, I am not. It's more like a 50-50 cotton evil blend, really. And what's this? I have two codes, 10,000 points each. They can both be yours. No, I'm sorry. I have to go now. What about you? Would you like some points? <laughs>